everyone, it's Emily from Cooper Festive Pattern Pilates. I hope you're all keeping well. I thought I'd jump on and talk about elbows because I'm seeing loads of them at the minute. So be it tennis elbow, golfer's elbow, I'm seeing it a lot. So tennis elbow tends to affect this side, golfers this side, okay? Now, with either, they're both really, really painful and definitely if you're suffering, reach out and get help because it can be a real pest to shift. And the most important thing is to try and identify the cold for it. So why have I got my elbow symptoms? That's key, okay? So the first thing I get people doing as an osteopath here is I get them icing the elbow where it's sore a good five minutes, two, three times a day. Okay, bag of frozen peas wrapped up in a tea towel does just fine for that. Or was a really good product called BioFreeze Roll On, you know, just get that on. That can be really useful too. I tend to encourage my patients as well to give this area a good purposeful rub, almost like a massage, okay? Good two to four minutes in the sore spot, maybe at the end of the day, just to try and relieve some of the tension, okay? Doing both areas if needs be, okay? I, you know, in clinic, I'll get the elbow joint moving, release these tendons and muscles for the patient. I always um, apply sports tape as well, provided there's no allergy, because I think the tape works a whole lot better than those supports out there, and people often prefer the tape. A lot of patients find the supports quite irritating after a while of using them. Um, and the most important thing is stretching, okay? So the one stretch I recommend all the time, and it gets both areas, okay? I've called it a prayer push. So we're in this position, thumbs pointing towards, okay? I'm going to hold each position for a good 10 seconds. So I'm taking my arms down and I'm going to try and keep my palms together. The moment they separate, like mine have here, I'm going to hold this for a good 5-10 seconds, okay? So I'm stretching my elbows. Then I'm going to turn this round and again, bring the palms back together. I'm going to hold for a good 5-10 to 10 seconds and then bring it up. And again, holding. And I might repeat this a good 2-3 times to keep the elbows and the tendons nice and stretched. I hope some of you find that useful. As I say, if some of you are struggling with your elbows, please don't leave it, because it can be a real pest, really difficult to shift otherwise. So reach out and grab some help. Take care for now.